You know, we've got to safety measure that. Yeah. Okay, we can only sleep at night. So it's it's daytime on the surface. I, I say we take our two wolves and head back to the monument and place them. Yeah. And then come back. I don't like that idea. I've got 13 um, levels also, so I want to use those up on some stuff. Yeah, I want to make, like, bigger. I've got 32. I want to make at least one max level enchant. Um, I'm going to go ahead and hit the chest real quick and bring back some helpful stuff. Actually, no, I'm going to leave it here for when we explore the other area. Some of it. Uh, and bada boom, bada bing. Cool. There's also, um, in that horrible, horrible area that, um, you died in. I know, i got to be more specific than that. But <laughs> the one over in Vrindstar that you died in. Mm -hmm. That one, um, there's a chest that has a bunch more random crap in it. So we're going to want to just... Make sure to clear that out before we leave. Let's mention that one that had like an iron sword and other various. Where crafts. the hell is the entrance to this place? Is it up? Do I need to go up? Okay. I know there's creepers. Is that lava? Yeah, it is. Right, got, got, it. It. got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay, cool. Woo! Ah, right. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna take a, take a deep, deep breath of this fiery brimstone air. Mm-hmm. We are in hell right now in that in that <laughs> place down there. That's yep. BS. Uh, and the strange part is that we really didn't die. I mean, you, you died that one time when ridiculous shit happened, but outside of that, it's been relatively not as horrible as it could have been. I think it's because we're actually being smart now and using our armor. Yeah, that's true. Our armor is pretty ridiculous right now. And it looks like it's turning to night. Yep. Sure is. Well, um... Hmm. Grab one of the wolves off this thing. There we go. I've got a few of each now. Yellow and gray. Normally, I'm not big on sprinting, but I think I'll make an exception this time. Although, I do like the knockback effect that um, when you do a sprint attack, that's pretty fun. Skeleton, you are an asshole. Spider, you are also an asshole. Okay. All right. So you got the um. You grabbed one of the yellow wools. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know what? I'll grab another because I ha I have to be I have to be part of the crew. And I'm not talking about the Ubisoft game. I haven't even heard of that one. Oh no, I have. I lied. It's a racing game, isn't it? Yeah. It's. Decidedly mediocre. You hate yeah. about that. I hate that. Yeah, I hate it because it's like it's not really particularly good, yet it's not interestingly bad. So it's like there's no reason for it to exist, and that's that's just kind of sad. Sounds like a lot of games that have come out recently, though, or yeah. how I felt about a lot of games that have come out recently. That's why 14 kind of sucked. That's why I didn't pick up Dying Light. Yeah, that one I've actually had a surprising amount of fun with because I was kind of very eh about it. But um, when I actually started playing it, I, I had a lot of fun with it, especially with co-op. Holy shit. Awesome. All right. I'm at the monument ready to place these bitches. Oh, <laughs> I just like instinctively started going back to uh, 
back to the uh, little home base area. Okay, I'm I'm almost there. Eh, there we go. Hi. Hello. All right. Um, yellow, and then light gray. Ooh. And you can take light gray because you're a Metroid player. I'll take the yellow. I gave you a sign. Oh. That's whatever. It's fine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, y'all oh my god <laughs> the light gray well, yeah that's basically what that room was we <laughs> tore that dungeon apart with creeper explosions i know like it is riddled to pieces actually i'm afraid to go back in there just because there's so many holes yeah well i mean at least the um there wasn't as much lava as there was, as there was in the um don't blow it area that was absurd yeah. All right, I'm going to make another bed for myself in here. Okay. Out of the other wall. Because I brought both of our beds from in here out there. Oh, yeah. Incidentally, I have exactly three light gray wools on my person, so... As did I. Nice. Let's see. I'm going to go ahead and... There we go. Awesome. What are you doing? There we go. <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> Excellent. We could have made a bunk bed. I wasn't even thinking about doing that. Oh, oh, sh Um. Yeah, that was a bad place for it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I had to destroy your bed there. Hope you don't mind. Uh, it's all good. <laughs> I thought you were going to oh. die in all that diamond armor and then respawn immediately and die again. It turns out I just had to... I think I just had to break this block to stop suffocating, but yeah, well, I'm just going to not be an idiot this time. All right. Well, that counted as us sleeping, but... um. Yeah. yeah. Okay, well, you're just going to spawn on the surface, just like old times. Yep. Yep. Probably right. at night in the middle of a bunch of creepers. So let's go back to that dungeon and see what the other area, where the that leads to. Yep, just uh, dumping my inventory real quick, like, well, most of it. There we go. And Dang it, I completely forgot half the reason I came back. Oh. I've got 13 levels on me. Yeah, I have 35 levels on me. So yeah, I, I sh we should probably take care of that. Yep. I'm going to put all of it on my bow. I think. Not a bad idea. We really don't have a good bow. So, yeah. And bows do last a while. Actually, you want me to put the 30 on a bow? Nah, I'm good. Okay. If you I need to bring the uh, I need to bring the uh, chest back inside. Oh, okay. Oh, turns out I had a pumpkin on me. Useful. You know, another fun thing is we did all that without potions, too. Woo, power bow. Oh, yeah, we got potions. I forgot about those. <laughs> yeah, we have a lot of potions. Um, I'm going to take a potion of strength with me this time. Yeah, not a bad idea with all the fighting we've been doing. Wait a minute. Oh. We placed the magenta wool, right? Which one was that? That's positive. I, that was one that we, I think we took a bunch of that because we were worried that we'd lose it or something. I'm going back to the monument to remind myself what the Magenta Wool was. Okay. Oh, that was the one where I threw it to you and I was trapped in a box of emotions. Oh, yeah. That was fun. I'm glad we started naming these so I can actually remember where the hell we got them from. Yeah. Oh my. Well, I mean, I guess this could be useful. Diamond sword, diamond sword, bane of arthropods four, knockback two. I like the knockback. That'll be actually, yeah, that'll be really useful when we get to um, lol spiders. You know, along with that other bane of Arth arthropod sword that we have. I can't say arthropods apparently. There, there we go. I said it right. Awesome. 
Oh, where did we put that? There it is. Cool. Okay, now we have two Bane swords. That'll be nice. Awesome. Armor's looking okay. I've got a few blocks, but um, I can get more on the on the trip. So uh, let's go ahead and head back and oh, to that other blocks. Yeah. Oh, we have a crap ton of clay blocks over there. I wouldn't okay. worry about it. All right, got it. So let's see. There's two other areas we haven't we haven't actually done yet. One of them was at the molten front, right? Um. Let me think. Oh no. Oh no! <laughs> uh, I did not realize you were walking up the path. What you gonna do about that big fat butt? Get oh. stuck. Oh. Grand we butt of repulsion. Oh, and we haven't even been to the fortress yet. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's gonna be fun. <laughs> I just have this really bad feeling about the fortress. We've been, like, specifically avoiding that area. Yep. Probably good reason. I'm kind of suspecting that that is probably going to be the hardest area. Because the black wool... I don't, I don't know. The black wool does not seem to me like it's going to be that hard. I mean, it, he could... Maybe he's got, like, a TNT trap in it or something stupid like that. But I'm just... The way I'm envisioning this, just throwing an ender pearl in, grabbing the wool, ender pearling out, and almost willing to bet that half the spawners aren't even going to be able to spool up in time. We're talking about the uh, the Ohio wool, the the one in yep. the nether, right? Okay, yep. that's the one we've been talking about the most. We're really hyping that up. Yeah, I just I kind of have this feeling in the back of my head that it's going to be a disappointment as far as black wools are concerned. I don't know. I think while you're trying to do the ender pearl approach, I'm just going to bridge over to it and see how lucky I can get by just bridging over to it. That would definitely be exciting, especially with all those spawners, because if I remember correctly, there were like about, what, 12 gas spawners and like a handful of were there blaze spawners there, too. I don't remember. I don't either. OK, I know there were some spawners that weren't gas spawners. Oh, hi, guys. <laughs> As I just hear this explosion in the background. And there's a dungeon. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was that other that other side. Or flare. Mm. Oh, um, there's a lit up area up here. I don't know if you noticed that. Up where? Um. Where are you? Oh, yeah, you're probably down your or <gasps> Okay, I'm gonna patch that up. Oh my god. Hi. 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 Uh, okay. Oh my god, redstone. <sighs> right. Oh no. Oh, redstone or flare. I think I get it because it lights up if you poke it. How did that one explode? He doesn't even hear me. What an asshole. I don't know. These creeps are being dudes, douches today. Major douches. Yeah, definitely the opposite of dudes. Um, I see little, you out there. Little thing over here. Well, I found little... zombies and a creeper. I know you're surprised. What little thing are you talking about? Oh, you found a like little area? Yeah, there's like a tiny little like alcove thing. Ooh. With a chest that has a bow, an iron sword, 64 arrows, cooked pork chop, and torches. I'll take some of that. Ah. Um, all right, good. Yeah, I'll take a pork chop then. You're probably going to end up inheriting half of this if <laughs> the past is any indication. Yes, daddy. Oh, you mean like the fact that there doesn't seem to be a door there anymore? And Oh, no, there's still a door here. I put this oh. wood here. 
All right. That bad, huh? Jeez. <laughs> Whoa. There's a lot um, more redstone here than I thought. 